Russian dancing. That comes as no surprise to a group of senior citizens in Windsor. They've been dancing up a storm every Monday afternoon for the last 20 years. Here's Percy Hatfield. I thought that you would be they took a chance 20 years ago. Legion Branch 594 out on Huron Church Road wanted a seniors program. Many of their Second World War veterans had retired and were looking for ways to pass the time. Mondays were a slow day at the branch, but at the time no one really thought the seniors program would turn into the success it's become. Have you ever been lonely? Clayton Moore was the motivating force behind the Monday get-togethers. Ted and Peggy Briscoe both served in the Royal Air Force during the Second World War and have been coming here for the past 17 years. Well, we met on the dance floor at an RAF camp in England. And since then, we've uh, been just dancing our feet off. We get all our enjoyment from dancing and it allows us to mix with everyone and it's a nice social gathering. Tommy Simpson is 84. He and Joan Burney have been dancing partners for the past three years. Joan lives to dance. Oh, I love dancing, yeah. What does dancing do for you? Keeps me young <laughs> and active. Dancing keeps this old Canadian sailor young and active too. He's one of the lucky veterans. Others have been slowed down by the passing of the years, but... Watching the dancers in its own way is therapy. And it's also an opportunity to stay in touch with old friends. And it gets you out of the house. You hear the music and see the people. Boss is 90. The walkers are here every Monday afternoon. My wife met me 70 years ago. On a blind date. On a blind date. <laughs> you're still going, yes, you're going, you're going strong. Papa John Robitaille helps make Seniors Day enjoyable. I like doing my line dancing, and I like the people I hang out with. They're all good people. Nice is a good word to describe the atmosphere at the Monday dances. At times there doesn't seem to be enough men to go around. Or maybe they just tire more easily. But that doesn't stop the women from enjoying every moment. While most partners have been dancing it seems forever, some have only been at it for a couple of years. Because we didn't know how to dance, then it, it not in our dancing is not in our culture, okay? And so we have to take lessons to learn it because I I, I like to dance. Dancing can be an elixir that prolongs life indefinitely. The music is as varied as the dancers and their ability. I think these are the best dancers in all of uh, Windsor, Essex County, and most of Ontario. <laughs> How about that? Along with you, and you alone, can thrill me like you. George Hart is a former state senator from Michigan. The Monday group of friends has bonded closer than many families. For a break, there's always a quick game of cards, but for the most part, they come to dance. Perhaps to meet new friends or dancing partners. They come to keep in touch with their friends. Monday afternoons are fun afternoons. No one ever thought that Seniors Day would be so popular and continue for so long. But it has set the standard, and they have the cake to prove it. I can't help Percy Hatfield, CBC News, at Branch 594's Seniors Day. Thank you so much, Percy. If I only had Mondays off. Please stick around. Your full weather forecast is next.